Ireland for each year. Officially, we are the host for CFR and CPC, so we are going to be doing a lot of work. <laughs> um, I will just do a little brief reason why this should be created. Now, we all know that years ago, over the years, when we uh, long time ago, there was a period in Nigeria where you could have as much cocoa and take it to the bank and they would save it for you and you're very, very rich. That was when agriculture was very, very pivotal. But over the years, we've seen a decline in the law of agriculture in, um, in Nigeria to um, streamline it because of the emergence of crude oil and definitely entertainment. Now, we realize that one major thing Nigeria needs to take forward as well is, um, what's it called now, diversification, to bring back agriculture. And when I look, the organizer show looked and said, okay, since entertainment is the big thing right now, and we're trying to bring back agriculture, how can we tap into the channel of balancing agriculture and entertainment? And to take it further, um, the next thing we're going to be doing is introducing very important guests who are going to be joining us on this table and are going to be employing today's event. Now, the first person I want to bring to the table here is uh, a member of the Corporate Farmers team, um, someone who has been putting together this whole idea, working with the entire team, in person of Mr. Aki Alabi. Please, you have to get a point here. Also joining them on the table, also joining him on the table, I should say, is. Um, one other person from the corporate Thomas team, the president of Mr. Prince Ajayi. Please like to be <laughs> Now, the next person I'm going to be calling, in as much as I love his outfit, and I love his stance when we're reading the national anthem, it's not more like a footballer, very, very agile. But um, he's somebody who has tapped lovely into this idea because we've seen the prospects already, an international organization coming in to say, what you guys are doing is beautiful, I want to be a part of it. And so it's here, AB representing Tayo Africa University, president of Mr. UQ. <laughs> also to join them on the table today is someone representing the Pan-African Equipment, who is also tapping into the beauty of this whole concept of Mr. Jamie Brixton. Really one of the ways we joining us from the also, I've been told, um, representing this humble organization which hosting us today, IITA, I can tell with us in person of Tomiwa from Bayer, all, all, all the way also. So that's just will be joining us also very soon. Also, we have somebody joining us from the very, 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 very renowned Toto Elevate Foundation, who is going to join us in person of Mr. Boy, is it Mr. or Mrs. Ayo? Okay, Mrs. Miss Moyo. Miss Moyo, I will see you. No, come on, yeah. Okay, we're also still coming. Okay, so we have a lot of people still coming. Okay, also um, to recognize these important people, I don't know if they're here from Apex Nigeria, Mr. Ayate Jubalu. To recognize the presence of the production coordinator of the entire reality show, in person of Mr. Ola Abola. Good morning, all. Uh, first of all, I want to thank uh, each and every one of us for making it today. Uh, it's a meet the contestants event where we actually want to see you one on one, see your faces, and actually let you know uh, what's driving the passion, what's driving this initiative, and the reason why we need to do this at this particular time. Uh, as the host you know, said in his uh, introductory comment, that it's high time we start seeing agriculture in a different perspective. And we at corporate farmers want to do it in a different way entirely. I know most of you have actually been to our radio program, if not all, very few of you have a radio program that um, comes up every Friday, you know, at Metro FM. Uh, for us in CFI, we want to change the mindset of every Nigerian youth towards the way agri is perceived in various uh, enterprises. I talk about agri health, uh, the energy part of it, the business part of it, the finance part of it, and also uh, the technology part of it. But we need to create a platform where the government can see, where private stakeholders can see, where uh, foreign investors can see, that uh, there is a way in which agriculture can be perceived, and that is through the media. Uh, we have a joint project with the IITA uh, in Ibadan. Uh, so <coughs> that's why we, we know this program. So, and, uh, it's about this uh, reality show, it's a very, 
innovative. And uh, it will be a gateway to call uh, in, uh, attention and investment in agriculture, uh, not only in Nigeria, Africa, but also from Japan and uh, all over the world. So, and, uh, so we want to take part in this uh, show to, uh, to show every use in the world. So, and uh, actually in Japan we also have the uh, same uh, challenge that, uh, which is that uh, the young people, is, uh, most of them not interested in agriculture. They forget about agriculture. And, uh, we have the same problem in Japan. So we want to know, we want to learn from this reality TV show what we can do in Japan and uh, other countries. So uh, that's what we want to do with the partnership with them.